right, we're going to show a nice search option that a lot of people are not aware of. Uh, we're on the uh, Display Material Master screen, MM03. And um, what you can do on this screen is, uh, well, let's first look at all the different searches we have. Do the drop down here so you see all the different types of searches we have. And I'm going to go ahead and stay on this top one here. But notice the first row in this search is Material Description. I'm going to come out of here. So what you can do from the front screen is you can actually type equals and then whatever you're looking for. And you see in my history I've already um, uh, been uh, testing out a, a bunch of these. But I can look for, for example, um, screwdrivers. And I can either press enter or hit the button here either way. And I'll get a list of all the um, uh, materials that have a uh, screwdriver in the description. So that's a, a really uh, nice option. Um, and then if I switch over to another view, uh, I'll come down to this one here. Um, course bundle name is the uh, top row. And so, um, and, and there's all the different courses. Okay. Now, um, SAP will remember the, the last. Um, uh, screen you were on for, for that search so you'll see if I come back uh, to the main screen and then go back to MM03 you'll notice it's still got that uh, as my search that uh, course bundle screen so if I type in here um, equals uh, I want to see any courses on um, cranes press enter you see I see the courses that are uh, on uh, crane operation Okay, now uh, something important I want to um, show. Uh, notice I I typed this um, in mixed case, right? So capital C and then all lowercase. Uh, if I would have typed just crane, and you can see I had that in here, and I press enter, notice it does not find any courses at all. Um, so. Clearly that field is case sensitive, but remember when I typed in screwdriver, right? That was all lowercase, but yet, oops, sorry about that. Let's see, let's, I'm on the wrong, let me switch back to the right view there. Okay. And then remember when I typed in screwdriver, right? Even though I typed that all lowercase, even the stuff that was uppercase still showed up. Um, and even if I were to, you know, I don't know, do something a little different, like screwdriver like that, it still shows up. But on, on that uh, other view, I had to have, have the casing exact. Now, why is that happening? So that is happening because of the domain uh, that these fields are assigned to. So. Um, um, something to let me get rid of that so you can see this here something to keep in mind if you have a developer maybe help you to develop a new search um, I would recommend that the domain not be case sensitive and I'll show that here in a second and the reason is exactly this you're gonna get frustrated trying to search for certain text because you unless you got really strict standards on creating your material masters you're not going to know if that description got created all uppercase uh, or mixed case um, and it's going to be very very challenging so notice on the material description I'll press F1 here and then we're going to go to the technical information and then um, we're going to drill into the data element here so I'm going to double click on the data element and you'll notice let's see if I can get that to minimize um, that the domain on this is a character 40 and if I double click on that notice that the lowercase checkbox is not marked so whether you type lowercase or mixed case or all uppercase uh, what's going to happen during that search is SAP is going to force it all to uppercase and it's going to it's going to find those those entries um, now if I back out again Let's close this all down. Sorry, this video is maybe a little long, um, um, and I'm getting into some 
more advanced stuff. But but even as a, a basic user of SAP, if you're like I said, if you're helping to provide some requirements on maybe a custom search that you want, this is just a good thing to to mention to a, a, a developer. Um, so notice though on this course bundle name, I'm going to press F1 there, go to its technical information, and here's its data element. I'm going to double click on it. Minimize this so we can see the data dictionary here. And notice its domain is text 40. And I'm going to tell you right now, almost any domain you see that is text something is going to be case sensitive. Um, uh, and these are uh, standard SAP domains, and most of these are going to be case sensitive. And you notice it is. It's got the little lowercase checkbox marked. So that's why you got to get the um, casing exact if you're trying to use uh, that shortcut on this screen of equals uh, whatever you're looking for. Um, okay, so I ho hope that was a helpful video from a couple perspectives. You got to see a, a neat uh, shortcut that has been around for a long time but a lot of people aren't aware of. And then, like I said, if you are uh, providing some requirements on a new custom search, you can uh, m mention the, um, the that lowercase checkbox to the developer that it might be smart to not to use that. Um, but if you've got really strict um, standards on your material descriptions, then may not matter. All right. Thanks for watching the video. Take care.